Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name's Alice for those of you that don't know me and uh, this is actually the first time that I've spoken properly on my channel. All my other videos have been purely singing videos. So the reason for my video is that on Thursday I was lucky enough to go to the first live performance since lockdown. It was at the London Palladium and it was a concert from Beverly Knight. It was amazing, like it was so good to be in a theatre again and to watch live music. So the reason for this performance at the London Palladium, it was arranged by Andrew Lloyd Webber and um, he wanted to prove to everyone that we can open the theatres again and that although there is social distancing it can be done I mean I know that he said in his speech which I will put um, in the video later on the theatres do need to be at 70% capacity for a musical to be able to even break even so we need a date when the theatres can reopen without social distancing but basically I received an email at the beginning of the week inviting me to this uh, show on Thursday the tickets were free once we'd purchased tickets we received a confirmation email and with that email came a list of guidelines and rules for the day so these obviously included things like you have to bring a mask because a mask has to be worn in the theatre at all times and also to inform you what time to turn up because they staggered the entry to make sure there wasn't too many people queuing up outside at one time and also confirmed that there will be a contactless bag check and also you do get your temperature checked as uh, you walk in which of course again is contactless. All the seating was social distance, there was I think two, two to four seats between each group of people and to be honest I think it was run very very well, it, everything was uh, smooth, we didn't have to queue for ages to get into the theatre, it was quite quick, we filled out a track and trace form, the normal stuff that's going on at the moment but I thought I would vlog the experience for uh, people that are wondering what it will be like or what it could be like when the theatre do reopen. I thought it'd be nice for people to see the first ever live lockdown performance um, for all them people that didn't get to see it. So without further ado, here's the video. First time in London since lockdown. <laughs> the London Palladium to watch the first show in lockdown with Beverly Knight. Looking forward to it. It's very, very quiet in London, isn't it? Extremely quiet. So quiet. <laughs> again. It's been so long. It wasn't that long getting in either, was it? No, like five minutes. Let's do a bag check and they did a temperature check. We'd stand on like a little spot and they took your temperature in there. Hmm. It's good, can't wait for the show to start. I think this will amply prove why social distancing in theatre really doesn't work. It's a, it's a misery for the performers, I know, and thank you Beverly for being uh, so brave as to do it. <laughs> One thing I would like to say is I do believe that Oliver Dowden is really trying to do his best for all of us. I, I know it's a, a difficult time and he's obviously had an awful lot of other things on his plate as well. And um, I think he's, what he's tried to negotiate for the arts is great, although we'd love to know what really that package means at some point. It might be quite helpful. Um, but um, this is why we're here today, because 
I want to stress one thing, that the measures that we've taken at the Palladium are not about just getting the London Palladium open. It's nothing to do with that. It's about my passion for the theatre and for the live entertainment all over the country, all over the world. Theatre is my life, and it's the one thing that I really feel that I can do is to give something back to the profession that has been so good to me. But we do need a target date when we can reopen without social distancing, because we cannot, <laughs> we cannot work. It's not economically possible for a, a theatre to work with social distancing. A musical needs to take about 70% um, capacity just to break even let alone repay its investment or anything on those lines. But even so, we absolutely have to have our theatres able to be full again. And one final thing, in emphasising that, I think it is vital, vital, that you understand that this is not about my theatres, it's about getting all venues where live entertainment uh, can take place open. Michael Harrison, who's one of the great pantomime producers in Britain, that if he doesn't know by August the 1st that the pantomimes can open and without social distancing, that he cannot proceed. And that means that the lifeblood, the thing that the regional theatres depend on, will just evaporate and go, and this cannot be allowed. We must, must get the regional theatres open. So I would make one, one thing to Boris and just say, give us a date, mate. <laughs>
It was actually really good. It's so nice being in the light of warm, isn't it? Mm. It's just nice being back in the West End. Hopefully this is the start of more things opening and more shopping. so much for watching and um, if you did enjoy it please do let me know in the comments below um, as this is the first video I've ever done uh, like this so if you do want to see more of these type of videos then please do let me know overall I thoroughly enjoyed the, the experience like I had the best afternoon hearing live music Beverly Knight was amazing and um, it was just great to be back in that theatre environment again so fingers crossed this is the start of theatres hopefully being able to reopen and then hopefully not long till social distance uh, doesn't have to be a thing in theatres anymore don't forget to like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video and I shall see you next time bye bye mm -hmm.